I think the most challenging thing about doing public art is that the piece to me has to look like it belongs there, like the architect had it in mind when he designed the building and that it looks like it's always been there. I consider myself not to be a modernist or a postmodernist, but to be simply a folk artist. That uh, enables me to just do art that feels good. When I decided that I wanted to move from doing the film industry, which is what Los Angeles is, I wanted to do something, a monument to an artist, after I had been spending all this time as, as an artist. And I be, began to think, who do I paint? Ed Ruscha. Ed Ruscha came to me the same way that Steve McQueen did. To me, he was this complete individualist, the way McQueen, McQueen was. Uh, in the art world, and so it was, it was just no doubt about it. I had to paint Ed Ruscha in 1978. I contacted him, and he was kind enough to. He didn't know I could make him look foolish out there, but he's okay. Go ahead, and uh, and I did.